Hi friends, good afternoon. In this video tutorial, we will talk about factorial number. So they'll ask you to write a program for factorial number, right? So before we jump into that, you guys know that we have an institute called Ramesh Soft at Amir Pet and SR Nagar. And as well as in YouTube, we have a channel called Ramesh Soft channel. Here you can see a lot of videos are there on Selenium, Java, Listeners and JDBC SQL and Git tutorials. You can see a lot of style was protractor, many things. Please subscribe the videos now so basically what is a factorial number right suppose if i give 5 so the output should be like what 5 into 4 sorry 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 what is the result in total here now 20 60 120 should go like that so we need to write the program for it right now see here very easy let me write the program and then i'll explain you the logic now right click i'm taking a class factorial test let me write the logic first and then i'll explain the logic now you guys what i'm taking so i'm taking two variables i'm taking one variable in some fact is equal something i'm giving some number as five or if you want you can read it number of a's are there right yes now what i'm doing is i'm taking one for loop int i is equal to one because it should not start with what zero because zero into something it always become what zero i is equal to one and then i less than r is equal to i less than r is equal to what is that let me give some number something as i'm giving it as a something fact i plus plus now you know what i'm doing it now now i'm taking one more variable let me take this one as number and i'm taking one more comma fact Initial I am taking this one as 1. Now see what I am doing it now. Fact is equal to fact into i. Right? Yes. Now after the for loop outside of it, I am writing like uh, factorial of, of what is that plus that number plus now what is that is plus what is that fact yes or no yes now observe here now now observe you know what i'm doing it now let me explain the logic now what happens exactly now i is equal to 1 is there 1 less than 1 is equal to 5 true or not yes it is coming here now fact into i fact is having what is the value 1 1 fact is having what is the value initially 1 into i is having what is the value 1 so 1 into 1 what is the value 1 so initially fact is having what is the value fact is equal to 1 yes or no yes after that i plus plus what is the value now 2 2 less than or is equal to 5 true or not yes it is coming here fact is having what is the value 1 into i is having what is the value 2 now 1 into 2 what is the value now 2 so fact is having what is the value 2 again it is coming back 3 3 less than r equal to 5 true or false yes it is coming here fact is having what is the value 2 into 3 what is the value now 6 so fact is having what is the value now 6 again it is coming back here 4 4 less than r is equal to 5 true or false true it is coming here fact is having what is the value 6 into i is having what is the value 4 what is the value now 6 4 is 24 now what is the value 5 5 less than r equal to 5 true or false yes it is coming here fact what is that value 24 into what is the value of i 5 so what is the value 120 and then i plus plus what is the value 6 6 less than r equal to 5 true or false false so simply it comes out of the for loop and it's printing factorial of a number 5 is what is the value 120 just check it out here now 
right click run as java application see here what is the factorial of 5 what is the value 120 this is a way to write the program for what factorial number thank you guys have a good day